Ah, welcome. Uh, today we're going to take a look at how you make music using artificial intelligence, AI technologies. Um, my friend Kat here is a DJ. Uh, she's done it both professionally in real life as well as uh, doing it in virtual worlds like Science Space. Uh, she also did, I believe, a little bit of that in Second Life as well. Uh, and has even run her own open sim server before too so she's got quite the experience when it comes to the metaverse and um, now she's getting quite the experience when it comes to work working with ai music so she just recently helped me learn how to use ai music generator generators and how to create the songs and the nuances of it so without any further introduction this is Catherine yar hi everyone Okay, well, we're going to take a look at uh, what I reckon is one of the best music um, AI websites out there, which is uh, Sauna AI. And I'm going to uh, start sharing. I don't know. Can you see the website, guys? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, we're seeing the GIMP. You're seeing the GIMP. Okay. Yep. Um, let me just switch the uh, share here. Okay. Um, that's pause, resume. How do I change it now? That's new share. That's it. Um, okay, here we go. Seeing it now? Now you're still on your picture and GIMP. Mm -hmm. You might have to stop the share and then restart with a different share. That might be okay. your easiest way. Okay. Uh, how do I stop share? Oh, there might be a toolbar that's uh, floating around someplace and it would have a Oh, um, yeah. Stop share. share. Okay. Yeah, yep. we got that. Now we need to uh, share screen. And I got to pick that one. Okay. Yeah, I'm all, all new to doing Zoom. <laughs> oh, yeah. And the buttons go everywhere. That flying toolbar goes yeah. all over the screen. <laughs> okay. If you can see uh, the screen here. We see it. Yep. That's, have I shared chat GBT? I think I've shared chat GBT. Yep, can yep. You we're seeing it... you on that one. Uh, you're on Su Suno right now, but you're on the I'm list on where it shows the pictures up in the th thumbnail. Yeah, that's okay. You can yeah. you, can, you can see it. Yes. Yes. That's well, good. this is uh, this is Suno. Uh, this is the library of my uh, attempts and field attempts at <laughs> making music. <laughs> and here, so basically, when you come to this website, of course, you'll be asked to sign in and create a free account. Now, you do get some uh, 150 uh, free tokens a day to use for to make songs. But the songs you make with the uh, tokens, you cannot use commercially. So you have to have a paid account, which is not very expensive. It's, I think, about 8 or $9 a month. If you're paying monthly, you can get it a bit cheaper if you pay a year subscription. Yeah, I'm paying like 10 bucks a month on that. Yeah, and it gets you... It gets you, I, I'm doing only 925 here because I had like two and a half, three thousand credits on here, but I've been busy making songs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and can you spell out the uh, URL form so that they know how, how to find it? It's S-U-N-O dot A-I. Okay, thanks. Is uh, Sona. I'll post it into chat also. Yeah, any, any, um. If you just do that in a search, uh, Sona VSA AI, it'll find it. And uh, yeah, it's there. Um, okay, uh, what else now? Um, here we have our create button. So this is how you would start to make a song. And when you first come to this create, this is what you'll have. Hmm. Just this little box here. And if you want to start making a song in here, you can type in something like country, Christmas. Oh. And you just click generate and it'll generate a, so a couple, well, actually two songs. It'll generate or two versions of the song for you to check out and ha have a listen to. So that's just so interesting. And it is... Is it a format like the first word is a genre and the second is a subject yes. or does it? Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, you, you need the genre and... and um, you can kind of put anything you want in there. Like yeah, you, you can put little, but you could put you You could write a book on it if you wanted to. Yeah. Wow, wow. Yeah. You know, you but, could, you could yeah. write in here a uh, Christmas song about um, a family gathered around the fire or something like that, you know. You can write it longer there. 
But one thing you will find with it is it acts like a little kid. It'll it'll do some of the stuff you ask and other stuff it won't do. Yeah. You know? But here is where it gets really interesting in here. So that'll generate a song, but it'll be very short. It'll be one verse, one chorus, and that's it. Once you've got one that you like, then what you have to do is come over here and you come down to this button and I can't get it for the, the, the cameras, uh, the zooms in there, right up to the top of it. But um, we're, we're seeing it well, so I don't think that window that's coming. Yeah, well, this problem. first one, it says continue from this clip. Mm -hmm. So then you would click continue from this clip and it'll open up to this. And see if I click, um, let me clear that. I don't want all that lyrics in there. So if I select all that and delete it. And I take out that at the minute. And I go to here and I continue from this clip. See, it puts the clip down here. Wow. Then I can add more words here and generate another one. And once I have two that I two that I like, so I can have the first um, verse chorus on the first one, the next verse and chorus on the next one. Once I have two that I like, then I can go here and I can go um, get whole song and it'll combine the two into one song. Oh, I see. Okay. That's why it calls them clips. Yeah. Okay. The clips. But sometimes they're a little bit different. It's, yeah, sometimes they're a little bit. You got right. You might take two or three goes to get the mix right and get, get it to sound right. The other thing that we found as well is that at, before... If you just do what we just, I just told you to do, it will give you a good chance that the words will just come straight in with no intro on the song. But if you put in brackets like this and put in intro above the words, and then you go down and do the, um, you know, you, you, your verse, then you go down and put in chorus uh, and that and generate it. You'll get a song with a good start with a bit of music at the start. You just leave the intro, just leave it empty or you can put a few words in it if you want. But I just leave it empty and it it, it, it adds a wee bit of music to the start of the song. And to translate for our American friends, empty means empty. Yeah, empty. <laughs> Oh, sorry, Northern Ireland accent. That's okay. Yeah, but yeah. Now, oh, of and, course. Uh, uh, just to let you know, Joyce sends her regrets. Uh, she would have loved to have been here for this, but she's been without power in the internet since this morning. So, my goodness. Wow. So, here I've generated a verse and I've generated a chorus. And then I can go and bring it down and go up there and put the intro in. Just like that. So you have an intro, a verse, and a chorus. And that'll give you a little bit of music at the start before they sing it, if you get lucky. <laughs> and um, so I normally do that. And then when I have one that I like, as I said, then I do from the next clip. And then what I do, well, you have two choices here. You can then just delete this stuff. And I normally tend to leave the chorus the same because it gives the song a bit of a, you know, a theme. And um, and then I do generate again and it'll give me the next, um, it'll put in the next verse. And then you always have the option of going in there. If you don't like one, one of the words yep. or something, you can change it. Just you want to keep the, Read the flow. It, change it. You want to make sure the flow still works. You yeah. Know? Yeah. The other option you have when you're doing this, of course, is you could take this and go to um, the likes of chat GBT here. And then there you could just say... Um,
please finish this song. Oh my. Put it in there. And hit enter. And it should no. Well, let's say at the bottom there it had a note or something. That's there these, was something. Yeah, see there was an error in the response or something. Okay. I think you might have not liked um, the quotes. No, I normally put the quotes in. You do? Okay. Yeah. You see, I kind of do it reverse the cat. What I do is I started chat GPT. I generate a bunch of ideas and then I come up with the song and fine tune it myself. And then I start bringing it into Suno. Yeah, well, it, it's, I do, it's, it's. I do uh, a, set, a, a, a section at a time till I get the thing completed. But it, it's kind of a crapshoot. You know, so sometimes it works great, other times it doesn't, you know. Yeah. I don't know what's happened to chat GPT, but it's. Uh... Yeah, okay. Authentication token, it says. I wonder what, what that's about. I wonder if they the made website. it so it's, you got to pay for it now. No, not normally. No, there we go. Yeah, usually if you use the version 4, you've got to pay, but 3.5, I think, was free. Okay. You got that little thing on the top left for that. It's not pasting in, so if I grab it again, oh. copy. There we go. It's hard to do when the thingy is. It looks like it worked that time. Oh, it sure yep. did. There you go. And now you have um, the bridge. The verse, the pre-chorus, and all that, and it's up to you how much you use of it. So you can do the first with the intro, then you continue from that clip. You put in the next um, verse and chorus, and once you've got the next clip that sort of matches the first clip, then you can combine them to make a whole song, and then you can also then that counts as a clip to that whole song. Then you can continue from that and put a wee bit more on, and then you can put an outro on. But you got to build it incrementally a little. Yeah, at a time you got to build it, it up incrementally. It doesn't want to give you more than I think what about a minute before it yep. kind of craps out on you. Hmm. So you got to do it in minute chunks. So you're talking like and one really, verse and one chorus usually. And and really, uh song i think the longest one i got was about four and a half minutes i find that depending on the singer uh, especially if it's a female singer for some reason the ai tends to sort of sound as if it's been strangled the longer the song goes on. Oh, okay. huh. <laughs> yeah it doesn't want to sing so long this is in beta so hopefully it'll yeah. improve but yeah it can be like that but um now, how is the syntax with the way that you did it? Since you copied it from Suno and it already had the proper syntax, does it come back over okay? Yeah, it's okay. all there. Chorus, if verse, you, pre verse. If, if you go the way I do, the opposite, instead of chorus, it will have, instead of those parens, it'll have the standard rounded uh, parenthesis. Nope. It, it, and I have to change all that. Yeah. And so then sometimes it'll use like verse one, verse two, and it won't accept that. I have to have it as verse. Well, as you can see, it's come back with the square brackets, and yeah, it, 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 I've had no problem with it. How, how many verses did it do? It done the bridge, yeah, yeah. verse, pre-chorus, chorus. What's a pre-chorus? Who does a pre-chorus? <laughs> Some bands do. That's fancy, yeah. yeah. And does but, it accept but, all those different uh, transitions or no? I have never tried a pre-chorus, yeah. uh, okay. Joey. The only one I've tried is the bridge. The bridge worked, okay. The bridge worked, yep. Yeah. And what do you call uh, the one at the end? Is that close or outro? Outro. Outro. Okay. Outro. Yeah, okay. Like that. Yep. Yeah. It'll accept the outro too. Yeah, because uh, the bad thing with this is you it just like it gets to the last word and it kind of clips it off. Mm -hmm. So you got to do something to kind of extend it out a afterwards, like doing an outro without any music. Or another one I found is outro space uh, get guitar. And that way it what? plays the guitar to till yeah. close oh, okay. but but the thing with this box here is i could clear this out here and i could type in here pop upbeat 
something like that. So I want a nice pop-up beat song. And uh, I could, um, if I had my own words, if I was a writer, a songwriter, and, you know, wrote my own words, I could paste my words in here, make my verses and my chorus and stuff, and paste them in and have uh, this thing make me a song with my music or with my words. <laughs> Wow. Which I did for a um a song that I I wrote called Time. Um let's see if I can find it here in the library. So many uh things in here. If I can find the full version of Time. Uh, and then and then so, some sometimes. Oh, and of course was <laughs> Yeah, I can we'll, we'll go this. and we'll remix it afterwards. You might, you might find something you liked from one song you did and from another. Yeah, and you you can just take it into audio soft software and mix the two of them together too. I'm just trying to see. I, oh, I think one of is. the bad impressions that folks get about AI music is they think it's just a ripoff, like it's it's stealing yeah. somebody's music, and it's not. It's doing the exact exact same thing that a professional musician does. It has things that it's been influenced by. It has models in its head, and it's using that to make its own performance. This is um this is one that I done that I actually wrote the words to. So you you're getting a, a live preview of this. I've never played it to anyone. When I was young, the days were long. I hope the day would end. Waiting for Christmas to come around Presents from family and friends Monday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday The week gone around again The older I get, the faster it goes My friend, oh. When I was young, the days were long. I hoped the day would end. Waiting for the holidays to come around. It was fun again. Oh, it was fun again. Monday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, the week gone around again. The older I get, the faster it goes. Oh, that wasn't the full song, but um, where the full ones went. But anyway, um, but then you've also got a remix button there too. So if it's like yep. close, but like the pausing was a little weird, you you can do a remix and you might get a better a better version of it. But I wrote that song there that was based on the fact that uh, I have a friend uh, called Edge who comes to the Three at One Club. And I play games with them too. And many days we're talking on Discord and uh, you know the way people say the older you get, the, the faster time seems to be going. No, <laughs> yeah. Right. yeah. Yeah. So that's what that song's about and how how time goes fast. And when you're young, you're, you're like praying for the days to end. So as you could get to the holidays or Christmas or your birthday or something. <laughs> so um, that's what that is. That's a pretty is. song. I love the lyrics. Yeah. Yeah. So that was so I sat and wrote the song and I had it pictured as a country song in my head and I'm not a singer so I couldn't sing it or or do anything with it and this is actually giving me a way to turn it into a proper song. Wow! <laughs> and it's not just singing it, but it's it's mixing and you know applying any kind yeah. of effects and yeah. it it yeah. does all that. And no, there's a there's... little bit of reverb in there on the vocalist. Yeah. It was just yeah, wonderful. Yeah, it's nice. 
the um the what do you call it the um the other thing that people are I, I've seen some people do with this is generate a song get a rhythm and the beats that they like and the feel of the song that they like. And then what they do, there's an AI website where you can take that song and upload it and actually rip it to pieces. So you would be left with the guitar track. You'd be left with the drum track. You'd be oh. left with the, then they're taking that into their music DAW. Okay. And then they maybe, oh, I like that little drum rhythm there. They'll take that out and turn it into an audio sample and add it to their samples library, yeah. and then they'll use that to make a totally different song That's that they've amazing. mixed themselves in the uh, in in the DAW. Do you do you use a DAW? Yeah, I've got several DAWs. Okay, I'm a I'm a Fruity Loops user myself, so I've had that license for so long. It's been so easy to work with. Yeah, my favorite is um, a DAW called um, Mixcraft Nine recording studio Nine, okay i i use that all the time I, I i that's something i do with these songs if if at the end it doesn't fade out nicely i'll take the um when i first started i, I didn't know about the outro um putting the outro in right. and i would uh, have the song and the song would just like cut off at the end so I would take the song into the DAW, and of course, there you can do the uh, fade out uh, on the song. So, right, so I would, right. I would add fade that's, out. That's the acronym D A W, and it means Digital Audio Workstation. Yeah. Okay. Digital Audio Workstation. That's yeah. it. You got it. Um, yeah, a lot of people don't know what, like, an they're into music and stuff, they don't know what a DAW is. Right. And uh, for. I can actually show you Mixcraft 9 here. I'll have to change the... Um... I think I think knowing the name is fine. No, it's fine. I just got there, it up There are here. so many of those uh, software. Yeah, there's so many, but just, just for those who uh, maybe watch this and uh, don't know what it all is. Yeah, do you have a, a favorite platform, Dave, or, or Witch Whisper? Some people still mix What's the platform? Well, the with, just digital oh, for audio saving it, Sound, SoundCloud, I put my stuff up. Are we talking about where you post it or what? No, no where, you, where you edit audio. Yeah. Oh. Like, I use Log, 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 Logic Pro myself. Logic Pro. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Well, this you is use Cakewalk. Is that is that what you said, Witchy? Well, I have used it. It's not my favorite, though. I've, okay. I've liked the other ones. I just don't know their names off the top of my head yeah yeah pre-sonas i think has one as well it's pretty good what's that free free one that we got cat with some of our stuff was that pre-sonas or was it no i one? we got this one here that i i use um the mixcraft nine recording studio okay i uh where's my um Where's my little song here? Should be in here. Did I see it? Yeah, I did. I see a country Christmas. Is that? Yeah, that was another one, but it that was never... another one. Okay. Yeah. So this was another song I generated with uh, Sona AI that I played at the nightclubs. Maybe not playing here. What's going on? And this is on speaker. And on headphones. I put ah. Uh... Oh no. Yeah, I'll need it on there. You must need uh, the virtual audio cable for uh, for streaming, for DJing. No, I actually. Oh. oh, here we go. Is that too loud? I think that's way too loud. I think it's fine for me. Was it? Yeah, yeah. But I play I play it loud too. Feeling the rhythm in the air 
I'm still waiting to have all oh, AI right. music shows one, one, one of these yeah. days. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. Wow. So um, that's one I play at my show uh, at the 3 at one Club. And I um, can't remember if I played it that night in uh, Open Sim. But uh, yeah, it's one of my... Uh, so it's one of my favorites and yeah, yeah I have played several, you did play one of, what, one of your AI ones yeah. yeah 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 and I have the country Christmas one as well that was another one um, objects a country Christmas the thing that amazes me is the AI is able to get so much data about things in the real world. Yeah. So it's yeah. like when you tell it something like you want an 80s mix, <laughs> it just really knows the stuff. Yeah. And it selected an upright bass. Wow. The face falling gently on the ground. Children laughing, sleigh bells ringing all around. Nice country. That one's up on YouTube. You, you on my channel. You can see it on there <laughs> or listen to it on there. Oh yes. Um. So yeah, there's a lot, lot you can do with Sona AI music. You can, uh, you can make uh, quite a range of music, <laughs> not just yeah, pop and, and and Kat, Kat brings her to to virtual worlds too. Can you show us a little, a little bit of your club as well? Do you have time? You, you yeah, broke sure. up a little bit there, Dave, but uh, yeah, you were asking about her club. Yeah, I just thought it'd be kind of cool because one of the nice things with uh, Science Space where uh, she does her shows on, on Saturday and Sunday nights, um, 6 p.m. Eastern time, uh, uh, is um, she has um, interactive stuff inside the world. So as the music is going, the lights will pulsate and the dance floor pulsates with the, the music. So it's kind of cool that they have that, you know, that's something I, I haven't seen you, in any of the other worlds. Sorry to interrupt you. I hope sure. now that Science Space will not crash because Science Space can be a little bit memory intensive on the PC. So hopefully I won't <laughs> die. Yeah. Oh, I hope not. Uh, yeah. I was uh, rendering video today and it, it just ran out of memory. It didn't tell me. It just stopped. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how heavy Zoom is, but on the calls but hopefully you know, zoom is too bad on that it's, it's more of a lag issue than anything else you might run into but mm -hmm. um but the other thing too is i think when you do your shows you're actually using multiple computers so you have one for your music and one for your world i'm just that... um not the um i'm just trying to get back to science space is Stopping my uh, Zoom screen from coming up, I can't. Oh. Can't get my Zoom up. That's okay. <laughs> uh to to do a share. Uh, where did it go? Nice to show. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, it's um. Why I can't bring up the uh, the Zoom window again? Uh, to share the thing. Um. 
I can bring up the ordinary, um, you know, before you join a channel. And I have your, I have you, I've lost a lot of people here. Uh, in, in Zoom, you, you might have a, um, uh, uh, minimized. I've got yeah. you, yeah, I've got you up. It, it minimized, but it's, um, I can have a single person up, but I can't get, you know, the, the, the floating toolbar with the, yeah, yeah. with the, um, share thing. Mm hmm for whatever reason, it's, I've lost it. <laughs> it. It goes in so many different places. Um, if you see our video, there might be four icons across the top of that little window. And there's uh, there's one icon that shows a grid view. Um, no, all no. I'm seeing is a little video of you with... Um... Oh, like there it's... we go. Got it. Okay. Got it. Okay. Okay. Yep. Uh, let's see, cool. share screen, three at one club, share. I, these interfaces, I tell you. <laughs> there you go. Hey, there now, it is. Yes, and I may have to start up the other computer and stream some of my AI music because I have an 80s radio station playing and I don't want your video getting copyright strikes on oh, right, right. YouTube. So I'll uh, start up the music um, computer over here. But yeah, this yeah, is cause the, the one uh, thing is like when it's playing the music, it's it ha you have to actually have the sound turned up for the visual effects, right? Isn't that? Yep. The, yeah, you do. Yeah. It works with Science Space. Yeah. Yeah. So if you mute it, you're not going to see any, any of the effects. So normally only I'm on a timer. There's a daily quest here to give you some in-game silver. <laughs> That guy gives you a quest, which is basically just to follow the line into here and mm -hmm. uh, uh, and uh, when you get to here, you get some silver and then you can take that quest and go on up and get some more silver um, just to give some people some silver. Uh, is that an in-game currency? I'm yeah, okay. that's okay. that's yeah, an nice. it's. It's it's yeah. it's one of yeah, them they currencies. Gold. Okay. They have silver and gold. Gold's worth real life money, just like London dollars. Yeah. And and second well, I life. I remember now. That's right. That's that's yeah. triggering a memory cell. Okay. But uh, silver is basically just for people can either sell stuff for silver or they can sell it for real life uh, money, which is gold. Right. Here. Or, um, or you can even offer it both ways if you want. That way, some somebody can pay you if they like your work. Or they yeah, or they can get it for free. Yeah. yeah, so you can do both in here. So this is a club I built um, using the the difference between this and Second Life is with Second Life you can build stuff in world. In here you can't really build stuff in world. This is all built with Blender and Unity. Oh, fantastic! And then using Unity, it's actually uploaded in here. So you have full control of the terrain. Uh, in, in Unity, you have full control of everything in Unity, scripting everything, and then you upload it to here. So I, I built all this, built the lights, wow. scripted it. Um, and they just have really cool things on how it can interact with sound. I, I haven't seen in any other world. Yeah, that is it one of the things, the Sam, kind of which cool. yeah. I really like about it is the fact that you can uh, do that. I just have to Type in a password over oh. here. Which is, do you still use something like a um, a shoutcast or a? Um, yeah, it's or... still use it's still shoutcast. Yeah. Okay. But I use a copy of Sam's Broadcaster, which is a professional um, yeah. broadcasting software, which then connects to shoutcast and allows you to stream. So it does. Um... So Sam's instead of butts is that kind of the same thing or? Sam's uh, shake you, uh, yeah. Sam's broadcaster, S A M S. Is that like butts or, or is sorry, butts Sam? A different no, it's different. Are you familiar with? So you're breaking okay. up badly, uh, Joey. Oh, I am. Okay, sorry. At, at times, yeah. Which whisper had a comment in there? I thought. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I, I was just saying that I use but, um. 
but I have used Sam's before as well. So I know I'm what just, you're talking about. Okay. I've been just using Sam's since all the way through when I DJ'd an SL and I've had it for so long. <laughs> um all right, let's put on that, that song and that song. And uh this is just amazing. Uh, you, none of this is easy. It's it's very complicated, and it's just I'm so impressed as musicians can pull this technology together. Yeah, yeah. Just and the co so, the COVID gave gave us a reason to do it too. You know. Oh, true. Right. And this is how I control the streams here. Ah, okay. So and she does that, have in world controls. Yeah. Is that region based? Or? Yeah, yeah you're in a, a simulation. So. Now we can see the lights going to the music. It's lagging a little bit, but yeah. It looks a lot better when you're in World. Oh, and I recognize the song. Yeah, because like well, the, as I the own the rights to this too. music, yeah. you see, YouTube can't do anything. Right, that's perfect. Yeah, so um, all these lights. I mean, if I uh, if I was to turn the music and the science based down, which I need to uh, minimize this a wee minute, I could get to it. I can't get to the. Um, And I get start to, to see more of the neon stuff, yeah. Oh, also in here you can use, um, whereas in the SL you would have to simulate real light. These lights up here are... Um, are broken at the minute actually in here. Why I don't know, but the memories of eighty five and neon streams. It could be the streaming too with Zoom, you never know. Could be uh a dance for utopia in nostalgic trash. They were working last night at the show. Fireworks exploding in the night in this retro reverie. Everything feels right. Let's keep on cruising in this time machine. Ride. Yeah, I don't know why them two are not working. I'll have to have a look at them. There might be something wrong with the server. Yeah, they're not holding the server value. And they'd, they'd be casting beams of light? Uh, they should be putting multicolored dots right out around the room here. Oh, okay. This whole place should be covered in multicolored uh, dots. Yeah, it, it's a road around. trip when you're in world normally. Yeah, okay. But this is the first time we tried to broadcast this on uh, Zoom too, so it might be with the stream. That would be my guess. No, they're they're not Joey because if I um okay. No, that's holding the value. But why am I not? Increase the value, but ah, there we go. This is coming now. Ah, there we are. Now they're on. See? Okay, I now see. we're starting to yep. see the light. There not too much, though, but normally like it a wee bit more. Um... There you go. We're starting to see. It's just the lag. You're not getting it quite to the same extent that you experience when you're getting world. This is another song I made. Oh, wow, okay. Very Miami sounding, yeah. Yep. Well, this is the one you're working in the 2D animation for, right? Yeah. Oops, we got her. Cool. Yeah, that's better. That's a wee bit more um, what it should be. 
this is fun. This is a bonus. We've, we've gone beyond the yeah. AI and we're we're looking at the. Yeah. And then, and then oh, we have an AI agent later. in world named Amanda. We all we yeah. all joke, joke joke that she hasn't taken a shower in years. I don't know how you would know that. <laughs> in science <laughs> well she she's always wearing, wearing the same clothing you know i see yeah i'll have to change her clothes someday <laughs> yeah does she have a role is, is she uh no yeah, well, she's just a dancer she's just the there to fill the floor of it yep. <laughs> oh. yeah. on the quiet well, isn't, nights isn't, isn't she part of one of the quests as well oh yeah she's also part of the quest to give you um silver but another thing I can do here as well that I've made into this is I've made this here effects and I must do some more. But like here for Christmas. Oh, the snow. I think so the floor will uh, fill up with snow. Put on my coat. <laughs> Make you cool. Hey, you feel like you're at home in Wisconsin, man. That's right. Oh, it's filling up. Sure is. There you go. Oh, and another thing we have in here as well, uh, with this being through Unity, we have actual uh, real life one. If you look at the flags up here. Oh, I see it. Yep. So we have the flags fly in here. Nice. Uh, oh, and even the, um, if I come here to these speakers and I zoom in, you might be able to see that the speaker is actually moving to the beat of the music. Oh, sure. Okay. How fun is that? So you can yeah, actually, it looks so uh, much cooler in the world. Oh, I, I believe it. Are yeah. we still on yeah. uh, copyright free music? Yeah, yeah, this this is my music. Another original one. Excellent. Yes. Yeah, these are mine. Uh, so they are. Yep. So you're you're copyright free while you're here. Um, there was something else. Yeah. So I have the snow here, so I can stop the snow. And like for Halloween, I can bring in the. Uh, I can bring in the ghosts. Oh, I see. Yeah. You can see them floating around. Um, for um, Valentine's Day, I can bring in gluten love hearts. That's lovely. That's wonderful. Yeah. Yep. So we've about 15 minutes left, but um, you know we don't have to okay. go the whole length, or, or we could go. No, longer. we can go on. Yeah. Uh, I I also wanted to show you another. Um, Sorry, I'll just stop sharing that. Uh, I mean, oh, I was going to ask if Witch Whisper had any questions. Oh, here she comes. She dropped out, but she's coming back. Yeah, if she has any she questions. Do you? Up. Yeah. Oh, no, she's, she's coming back. back. Oh, okay. she's in the waiting room. Okay, there we go. Hey, Witch, welcome back. Hey, Witch, Witch Whisper, welcome back. Sorry. Did you have any questions? Out. I got bumped out. Okay. Um, I don't actually. I do have one question. Can you, like? Just do the music without the singing, like yes. so that you can. So you that can, you can do instrumentals. Yes. Yeah. Yes, you can. I. I think Joey's done now more than. Have you done more of the instrumentals, Joey? I've done. I've done a bit of it. You you can put like uh, you can type in instrumental, so it could be first and then do space and then instrumental. Um, or you can tell it to write an instrumental song and tell it what kind of style you want. Mm -hmm. It'll probably come out. You got to test with it a little bit. If you, if you're looking for something in particular, I I can play or play around with it, and then I'll share back with you the prompts. Yeah. So if you ever want to do them yourself, you can. But you have 150 tokens on it for free every day, and I mean you could try just typing an instrumental. But I, actually, I'll I'll um I'll go back to Sharon Sona here, and I'll I'll I'll, I'll actually give one. it a go. Okay. All right. Cool. Yeah, I was curious about how long it takes for it to render. I know chat. Oh, it's almost instantly. Yeah. 
Amazing. Yeah, this is fast. pretty quick. Um, I, I'd say less than a minute. And you get two songs generally, unless you're unless you're combining them, then you just get one. No, you can right. somebody Tell spell to instrumental because my spelling I -N -S -T -R is I-N-S-T-R. I-N-S-T-R. U-M. E-N-T. E-N-T. A-L. A-L. Okay. I need a T before the A-L. So I need a T there. A -L. Okay. Um, instrumental um i don't know and what style are you looking for me Which whisper yeah yeah what, oh, what, um, give us a genre like pop uh rock whatever how about new age? Do you know the russian genre funk p-h-o-n-k like lorna mckinnett or something like that okay we'll try new age here and see what okay. it comes up with i can spare a few tokens well, thank you. So as you're seeing down there, you have two of them that are spinning. Yeah, what here. it's doing is it's making a set. It's making you two songs that are a little bit different. Oh, so that's One it calls Serenity. The other one is Journey Through the Mist. Of course, you don't have to keep these names. And the other nice thing about this is it when you do a song, like I Don't Fire Inside, it, it generated me these um, AI graphics of a phoenix, which you can then use on the song. <laughs> You're done now. Wow. wow. It's that oh. quick. Let's so you see. You go over your thumbnail and you press play. So did it generate lyrics? And you can but see it. It's just not putting them in? Yeah. It's not putting them in. No, it didn't. Did it? Yeah, it did on far yeah, right. Yeah, it did, but it just doesn't put them in. Okay. <laughs> And you can see at the very bottom how long it is. So it's like a 50, it's about a minute long clip, a minute and a half long clip, actually. That's not bad. Yeah. Yeah. But you want to cool. listen to it all the way through because you might tell an instrumental and it, like a little kid, might decide to do its own thing, you know? Yeah. Right. It's got its own personality. Let's see what the other one's like. Cat journey through the mist. And it, you could also probably tell with things with tempo and stuff. If it's going kind of slow and you want it to be faster, you could probably tell with things. Yeah, I, mean, I could, I could, I could, I could have put up. Yeah. You could, you could put in things like upbeat there, instrumental upbeat, new age. Yeah, and it'll give you a faster song. But the next, uh, like the next two that we do, could be faster. That's cool. And then you can take that and you continue it, which whisper to make it longer. You can tell it to add, add another verse to it, and basically, and then you finalize it into a song, and then maybe you add another verse. And you finalize it into a song. You just got to be careful if you go too long. It starts to act a little wonky. No, I think you. you I think you can go pretty long with an instrumental, Joey. Uh, you might, you might be able singing, to. Yeah. yeah, it's the singing that can go wonky, especially yeah. if it's a female voice. I find that, that the guys yeah. not so much, but the the, the females' and voices. I don't know for yeah. I don't know for sure, but you might be able to do just a thought here. After you've made the instrumental. You might be able to go to another AI, possibly Chat GPT or another one, and then take a URL for that song and ask it to write lyrics to it. And then it yeah. might actually write you what to sing to it. I don't and, know. You know, I don't know. You can do all no. kinds of crazy stuff these days. But That's yeah, cool. so it, it's it's yeah. wild that it can generate um like if we put a uh, up upbeat here, yeah. And see what or, it comes or the up other with. thing you might find, which is you might be able to go in make yourself a song you really like and you like the lyrics and everything, but you want to have an instrumental version of it, there's probably another AI that can strip out the lyrics and just give no, you No, there the is. There is. That's what I was yeah. saying earlier, yeah. that there is. Yeah. So can you explain the tokens or the credits? So on a free plan, you get 150 credits per day. Mm -hmm. So every day you come here, Which you is a lot to play with. Yeah. Yeah. Which is to play with. 
But the thing is, you can't use these songs for any commercial purposes, just for your own personal purposes. Okay. The minute you go to a paid plan, then you get all the rights to the music and you can do it for, you get a commercial license basically to do what you want with the music. And do different actions have a different cost in credits? I saw that one action there, uh, you went from 915 to 905. Yeah, so they that do. was like a 10 credit action. Yeah. Yeah. So it, I think that's... making the whole song making a whole song will, will cost you a wee bit more than probably um As the dawn See now I asked for an instrumental and it put the words in. Oh it's got words. Okay. Quite nice though. Well, what you can also do is you could do remix of that song, probably, mm -hmm. and then just type the word instrumental, and it might give you the exact same music, but with instrumental. Yeah, just a thought. You you got you got to try a lot of their different things with this stuff to see how it works. Yeah, yeah, play with it, but you can get some really amazing results. Wow. I mean, both myself and Joey there, he he's got some pretty amazing results. And um, Les, actually, who I thought would be here tonight, um, he actually has got some really amazing results too. Um, on this, um, I, 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 I started it like I started a science space sort of craze with this <laughs> when I found this website and uh, started using it and putting songs up and playing them at the club and uh, Les, he's a DJ in there and uh, one of the Science Space, he works for Science Space. He was like, he jumped in and uh, now he loves this uh, website too. <laughs> he's making songs. <laughs> I believe it. Now, I, I was thinking about maybe making an album at some point and doing music Me too. videos to promote it and see if it actually sells, you know? Yeah. I can imagine just getting together with friends in a room and, yeah. and working together on generating ideas and, and yeah. listening to it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So if, if you have somebody so if you have so if you have a paid plan, then you can commercially sell yeah. the music. You yes. have full rights. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. And see That's... the other thing you could do too is you could have them perform and then you add some vocals to it. Or add some instruments to it. Yeah, if you go you know, down an so instrumental. You can take it beyond just what the AI does as well. Yeah, of course. Right. And that's yeah, what a lot well, of people was, are doing. I was thinking of duets and things like that when you were doing yep. them originally because of the existing voices. But yeah, that's neat. Yeah. We're at about oh, five, I think... five minutes left, but I, I okay. wanted to know if, if anyone had any questions about about copyrights and about how do we feel as artists about what what's happening with these AI tools? Do we do we feel threatened? Do we feel um, glad well, to have some work relieved from uh, our process and our and our goals? That is a, 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 a entirely subjective um question because some people are downright against it hate it yeah that's it they're against it other people love it and for an artist i'm not a singer or a musician myself uh well i'm trying to learn to play some instruments but for somebody like um witchy whisper there who is an artist Rather than seeing as this is an outright creation tool, she's seeing the potential then that she can use it to make some of the music, maybe make an instrumental and then sing on the top oh. of it. She just she just got kicked out again. Oh, she must yeah. be having internet problems. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's... But Dave, yeah... I... What do you think about that topic? I think that it's... People are afraid of AI, and Schwarzenegger is one one of the big reasons. Schwarzenegger and Hollywood um, movies have really gotten us to think that AI is going to suddenly turn a, a, a switch is yeah a switch is going to flip and all of a sudden AI comes to life and it kills us all. And um, I, I don't believe that's the case. I don't think humans can actually create life that way. 
Um, I think what it's doing is the same as a human. I mean, a cover band can sing somebody's songs and nobody has a heartburn about it. But when AI does it, people flip out, you know, yeah. and and if even if it's just singing in a style that sounds like that band, you know, if it comes out and it sounds like Rush, but it's not Rush, but you're like, man, I really like the sound of it. I really like what they're saying, you know. I think it gets down to that utility factor, like many other things with AI. Once we see that there's greater value with it, that's when it becomes useful for us. Oh, and that's when we there's accept Wasper the technology. Back. You understand? Can I yeah. admit it? I've seen it admit yeah. pop up. So, um, so kind, of, kind of like with grandma, where she didn't want to touch uh, robotics <laughs> until she saw that there's a dog that would come in and clean her house for her. You know, <laughs> yeah. Once we see that there's greater utility for it, you know, it might be some people, they see Christian music being made with AI and they love it. Next thing you know, now they're more accepting towards it. Yeah. You know, it's that touchy-feely thing of how we feel about the technology. Right, right. And the, there's the thing, the thing with music is this is making unique, your own unique songs. And the thing with music is most modern pop music is made with the same three chords. Yep. Right. You know, it, it's it's the same combination of, of stuff just mixed in a different way all the time. <laughs> Which whisper? I'm glad you're back. I'm sorry uh, it, it, we lost I'm you. Sorry. It's just the right minute. Yeah, welcome back. Okay. I'm sorry. Well, it's just that <laughs> there's uh, I've been getting phone calls, and and when I when I go to hang up the phone call, it throws me oh, out of the it, zoom it, meeting yeah. oh, gotcha. okay all right i was but curious what you thought about the copyright and the 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 issues of does this take away from artists or does it add to artists well i've always felt that technology is always a a bonus to artists personally mm -hmm. and it's up to artists to adapt to technology exactly you no, know, well, that's what I was saying. You, you're, you're, you're um, already thinking, how can I take this and then make it my own, right? And add, add my own flair to it. Exactly. Yeah, take it into yeah. a mixer. Yep. Yeah, it's kind, of, yeah. it's kind of like Wikipedia. You know, if if we had fought that and said, no, we want to stay in the days of uh, encyclopedias. Reading a book. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Everything's got to be in an encyclopedia. It's like, well. It's a disruptive technology, but it's one that can make life better if you use it the right way. Yeah, I know some people have said, like, well, what if this takes jobs away from singers and stuff? And Oh, it will. It will. It's a definite possibility because the AI singing sounds quite good. But, you know, at the same time, if you can adapt to it and you can become part of it instead of fighting against yeah. it. Yeah. Right. But then, then again, at the minute, this AI, the songs that it's producing are excellent for what it is. But I still, and they sound quite good to me. On like, I I play my songs in the car, in the car, on have them on a USB stick, and I play them. Uh, right. But some will argue with you; they're not quite up to studio production. Producers and engineers might have quality. Yeah, yeah. detect the, things that yeah yeah. Yeah, you that's we we miss, but it'll evolve. It's in beta, you know. Yeah, but the average listener, I mean, when I play my songs mixed in with all the other pop songs and eighty songs and stuff that I play, nobody blinks yeah. an eye. They're like, "Oh, that song's great." In the, in the club, in the dance, it yeah, perfect. in the right, in the clubs, yeah. they they fit in perfectly. So I, I'm quite happy with that. The other, the other thing that was getting away. Sort of from the music, but not really. I like that website that I showed you earlier, and I'm go I'm going to show it again here. Mm -hmm. That does the I text. Okay. Yeah, I D E O G R A M. Okay. Yeah, ideogram. Yeah, this Ideogram. this site is so handy because you can put text on the things, and right. You know, you can you can do text. I I don't know. Can I see my um? Can I see my what do you call it? It's my the ones I generated. They were there. Oh, like a library or. Yeah, my library. Uh, um, notifications. It should be on there somewhere. But uh, this is the uh, 
Maybe. But yeah, text has always been a shortcoming of the AI. It's all kind of gib gibberish things in a lot of cases. Beautiful pictures, though. Yeah. And yeah. the other thing, too, is if you have something like Photoshop, a lot oh, of the here. AIs nowadays have things where you can come over the oh, top of one mine. and just highlight the area you want to fix and tell it what you want to fix or whatever, and just it, it'll clean it up for you. But yeah, with the right prompts in here, you know, you can get things like this or like this mass and developers one yeah, or logo and logo mark logos. Right. Yeah. You know, this this is and again, yeah, it's so not stealing it's this from anybody. Me. Well, it's just amazing me how how advanced technology is becoming, really. Yeah, exactly. So what I do with this is I use this to generate images for my music. Oh, that's so great. I do. Yeah, yes, so... I, I use this sound to make, uh, like, if I was going to sell uh, an MP3, I can use this to make a um, a cover for the song. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Yeah. I oh, mean, it amazing. does, it just does some amazing stuff. So we're, we're at about an hour, and I just I want to make sure. Do you think uh, we've covered all the topics that you were hoping to cover today? I think pretty much. I mean, uh, the music we, we've talked about. Um, the biggest thing is just get in there and, and play and play with it, and yeah, look for, look for other AIs as well that might be complementary because sometimes. You you get kind of an unusual thing when you combine AIs so that you were working with more than one at the same time. So yeah. I was using I was using GP Chat GPT I, GPT yeah. chat yeah. in Discord. Okay. Yeah. Like, but now it's not working anymore, and I don't know why. You could just go to know. Chat GPT. I on just the go internet. here. I just it's go to chat open AI. GB, open AI com and. Uh, to, that's where I use Chat GPT there. Yeah, if you just search for Chat GPT in a browser, it, it'll take you to that, and oh, you can log in with your email address. One thing that I I forgot to show you guys as well. Um, if I can find it here, uh, just give me a second. Uh, that's got me old. Oh, and speaking of Discord, there is also a Discord server for Suno. But yeah, that's run, what I was just going to show yeah. them, Joey. Mm. They run a Suno version. They run a Discord version of Suno, which isn't quite as good as the web-based one. No, but what well, you can what you can do if you're doing shows and you want um something like I with me DJing, um, there it is. Uh, I'll probably have I to advertise change. shows in Discord, but I don't actually use Discord during my shows. Okay. Oh no, not to use it during your shows, but to um Well, we use it too on shows as like a back channel too. It's it's pretty good for that. Oh, so this if you want is... to talk to people while you know things are playing for a DJ that works real good. Yeah. But this is where Sona AI uh in Discord gets interesting because you have the stuff to do the music, but you also have this one which is called Bark. And in here you can uh you can do like if I want something like um oh no wait a minute I need bark oh that looks pretty interesting yeah uh welcome to the actually it's better if I type three Let's spell it out yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. One, you know, if I do that, and then I can go here and so what I kind can of voice? Yeah. pick a, pick a voice here. Oh, that's sweet. I like that. Or or mm. I can do um random voice, and then I can. It'll yeah, take us a second or two, like. but yeah, when it finishes, it's yeah. not it's generating. Now, one thing too, when you're seeing these servers in Discord. You can actually create your own server, and there's generally yeah. a code that you can take so you don't have to look through a thousand messages to find yours. That's yep. one yeah. thing that I do, too. The and bot, that, that yeah. way you're kind of like doing it in private. Or you can also go here. Uh, I don't know if you knew this, Joey. 
Okay. You can go here and you can uh, look in here and under mentions and it'll give you all the stuff that comes up. Okay. I or, have, I have oh, no, own. sorry. There for, for you, look, uh, okay. send friends request. I don't know why it has me sending you a friend request. We've been a friend for a long time. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's weird. Anyway, did it generate this? Yeah, this is a wee bit slower than the website, but... Um, wow, so yeah, you if you guys want to friend me on Discord, I'm just Witch Whisper. Okay. Okay. That's cool. I'll have to write that down. So, um, oh, yeah, what, I've watched your videos on the other one. Um, what, what, what is the one that everybody's using now? Um, on YouTube, you mean? No, nah, the other one, the one that does the short little videos that are uh, trending all the time. Oh, TikTok um, or TikTok? Yeah, I, I see her oh. stuff on TikTok all the time. Are you watch was uh, yeah with yeah, the Y W W Y T C H W H I S P E R. Yeah, I'm just writing it down here. Yeah, and then well, I'll get you. In yeah, I wonder. You. I wonder if we're uh, ready to wrap up here. Okay. Yeah. And we can well, stop the recording. We can certainly stay in the Zoom and, and continue our conversation, but I this feels yeah. like a, a, a good break. Uh, yeah, it's a good point. Um, yeah, it's taken it a while to generate that. Um, okay. It appears yep. the night. Um, there seems to be a lot of people on it generating stuff. Right. Well, thank you so much, Catherine. This has been, no. uh, this has just been amazing. I really enjoy it. Yeah, it's it's such a fascinating thing, and you can you can just do so much with that Sono AI. It's it's I've tried a lot. I, I have tried a lot of different um, music generators, and most of them can only do instrumentals, and even then they don't do them. You know, they don't do them the, the way that does it. It's it's right. it's incredible. Yeah, it, well, it's I've, really I've made my I've made my own instrumentals using online DAW. Daws yeah. before, yeah. But oh. uh, this is this AI stuff is really neat. Yeah. And when I'm no, doing I've tracks, it's some... it's selecting instruments sometimes is the hardest part for me. And yeah. So the fact that this selects instrumentation and arrangement. Uh, yeah. Amazing. Yeah, and then if you if you, if you want to break your song down and add to it, as I said, take it to the website. There there is a website out there where you can take it. Um put the song in and break it down into the individual instruments and the singers and remove the vocals, download That's them awesome. as individuals, stick them into a DAW, and then you can, uh, the likes of Witch Whisper there that um, can sing, then could take it down, take the vocals off and just sing over the top sing of it. sing with it, yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. brilliant. Put your All own right. words in. Well, thanks again, Catherine. I'm going to stop our recording now, so and then uh, and then we'll pick up from there. So, thanks everybody for watching. Yeah, thank you. Bye bye.